One Newington woman expresses herself through tattoos, but she's not just an artist, she's a listener as well. News 8 photojournalist Tom Parent has today's Working for Connecticut. So I don't know if you want to start with one more than another, or if you want... Yeah, I do like these guys. Okay. Yeah, they're super fun. <laughs> with a lot of the tattoo shows, they've kind of brought tattooing out into the light. One can be great because it's getting a lot of people that were scared about getting tattooed, maybe more like comfortable the idea of people having tattoos. But I mean, we have to do some shading in there, but there's a lot of layers. But it also hurts us because it's making this industry more mainstream, which means anything's more mainstream, it gets more watered down. I'm Kelly Green. I work over at Nautilus Tattoo in Newington, Connecticut, uh, and I'm a tattooer. All right, here we go. I tried going to art school. I realized it wasn't for me. And so when I was in art school, I met someone who was really into tattooing. And he was like, you know, why don't you just go and learn how to tattoo? Because you seem more interested in that. Found an apprenticeship a couple months later and then worked my dues into where I am now. If you have a great apprenticeship, you're probably going to go home wondering if this is what you're supposed to be doing multiple times. There should never be a quick way to do anything, and especially tattooing with such a huge tradition. It's such an old school form of, of a way to do things that it should never be quick. The longer the apprenticeship, probably the better. I've been doing it for 15 years. From those Cherry Creek little heart roses to like the tribal to the like what it is now, it's it's an art piece. It's not just a tattoo anymore. Sometimes you feel almost like a therapist when you do this job. So usually the reasons they're getting that tattoo kind of come out while they're getting the tattoo. It, it becomes a lot more of a story and it doesn't always have to be a story with tattoos either. You could just get, you know, a snail in a blender for, you know, a reason. <laughs> I actually oh. have that tattoo, but it's actually for my grandmother. 